What's going on guys? It's KCash Vegas and today we are at Excalibur in Las Vegas. Uh, we're here, day one, let's go. So we are about to check in at the Excalibur. This right here is the hotel lobby located as soon as you come in to the left hand side at the hotel and casino. Let's go check it out. Then there's also options for basically mobile check-in in case you don't have time to come into the front desk. You can actually check in from your phone on the mobile app as well too. Alright guys, so here's the update. So I come to Excalibur and normally check-in time is around 2 or 3 o'clock. But um, my plane flight came in around 10 a.m. So I go to the front desk and um, they don't have the room that I have available. However, they gave me a better room for a little bit of an upgrade fee. I couldn't say no. Plus, I have the opportunity to check in at 10 a.m. and not two or three o'clock. So I'm super excited. I'm ready to see what this special corner Royal Tower room at Excalibur is. I tried to do the cheapest room here, but MGM didn't let me. So we're gonna do the upgraded room. Let's go. It's K Cash Vegas. All right, guys. So let's walk on over to the room. So over here, we're walking through the casino floor and we're headed to the resort towers, which are located on the back side of Excalibur. Okay, guys. So the theme for Excalibur is medieval Europe. And believe it or not, this hotel and casino opened on June 19th, 1990. So it's about 31 years young right now. Now there's a total of 4,032 rooms in Excalibur and total gaming space is 100,000 square feet. A lot of people really enjoy gambling at the Excalibur. It's fun. There's a big selection of slots, table games. There's a lot of space to walk around. Um, it has a really nice and exciting medieval um, vibe that's in here. So they have a signature attraction called the King Arthur's Arena. Um, and a couple of notable restaurants at Excalibur include the Steakhouse at Camelot and Dick's Last Resort. Now this is owned by MGM Resorts International and it was actually renovated three times in the year 2000, in the year 2006, 
and 2015. So let me know what you guys think and I hope you guys enjoy this walkthrough and tour of Excalibur Hotel and Casino in Las Vegas. This is KCash Vegas. All right, guys, so here we got access to the pool, the spa area, and also the resort towers, which is what they gave me as an upgraded room. So again, my intention was to stay at the least expensive room at Excalibur, but front desk said that room was not available. So for a little fee, I was able to upgrade to their resort tower, which is one of their nicer towers. Alright guys, so this is the upgraded room in the resort tower. This is a one king bedroom with a corner soaking tub. Uh, what I really enjoyed about this room was my view. It had an amazing view of the strip. It had lots of space. It had a really nice and neat corner soaking tub that's built into the rotunda of the castle area. So it had its own window. It was really, really cool to see. I really enjoyed that part of the room. I did not get a chance to use the tub, but it's definitely a nice feature to have. It adds a hint of excitement, some fun, and maybe also even some luxury to the room as well. I really enjoyed how clean and fresh the room was. Um, the carpet was new. Um, there were no stains. Um, it was just a very fresh, well-kept room. I like the mirror placements. I really enjoyed the desk as well, the window seat, um, and also just the view. You know, you get to see the whole entire strip. I had a view of New York, New York, and a roller coaster. It was really, really cool. A very nice uh, view. So if you do go in and check in at the Excalibur, see if they have a nice strip view room that's available as well. It really makes it so much more exciting to stay here. All right, so here we have the bathroom and it had a nice large sink, a large mirror, really good lighting. Um, it was well kept. It was clean. You know, it wasn't too luxurious, but I did enjoy the walk in shower. The water pressure was really good. It was clean. It was well kept. Thank you. 
So this room really caught me by surprise because all the stuff I heard from different websites and different channels talking about how they had a terrible experience at Excalibur. And so far, it's been a great experience. The front desk was really nice. Um, they gave me the option to check in early for a nicer uh, room. And the room itself is very clean. So, so far, so good Excalibur. And check out the tub, like that is really, really cool. So this is the resort tower with the soaking tub room and also a view of the strip. Thank you so much MGM Resorts for giving me this upgrade. It really made my stay amazing at Excalibur. All right, guys, so here we are upstairs at Excalibur and we're walking towards the food court. They also have a few shops where you can pick up some souvenirs. Um, there's even also a store that has kind of like bath soap and bath bombs as well. But the food court had your common items, Pizza Hut, Fat Burger, Starbucks. It also had a Schlotzky's. Um, there was also a place to have like Asian one thing I did notice though was the food court was on the pricier side. So, um, you know, things were in the 12 through $16 range for lunch. And that's, that's about average for Vegas, but I wasn't expecting that for food court food. But you definitely have a lot of options. Now, my favorite thing at the Excalibur was the buffet. And I did make a review on that as well. You can definitely check out that link. But the buffet is definitely worth it. All right. So now let's go check out the pool area. Now, Excalibur also has a pool, a fitness center, and a spa. So there's definitely some things for parents to do or if you're just looking to relax. Now, the pool was amazing definitely for the price point there was a lot of options to do at the pool um don't mind me being stuck um it said the door was automatic and i thought it was automatic but i had to push it anyways um the pool was great they had lots of palm trees they had a water slide um, i believe there's uh, four separate pools um, one of the pools had like waterfalls within the rocks. One was more for adults that had like day beds. Um, there was plenty of towels at the towel and pool services kiosk. They had a pool bar. They had a place to get snacks. Um, it was very spacious, very laid out. Um, I really enjoyed the pool area at Excalibur for sure. So overall, I wanna say that this is a thumbs up. I had a great experience at Excalibur. I would definitely stay here again, especially for the price point. Now I did not get the cheapest room, so I don't know how that goes, but the room that I got was the resort tower room with the view, and it was a great, clean, simple room. Um, the hotel is located on a strip, and it has a really good price point. People working there were super friendly. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. This is K Cash Vegas, and look forward to showing you some more cool things in Las Vegas.